This will absolutely blow your mind about digestion. It's not just acid in your stomach. It's a coordinated chemical assembly line powered by over a dozen digestive enzymes that act like molecular scissors cutting nutrients into absorbable bits. Everyone thinks digestion equals stomach acid, but here's what's truly wild. Enzymes do most of the heavy lifting, from your mouth to your colon, each one specialized for carbohydrates, proteins, or fats. Step 1. Salivary amylase and lipase. Salivary A amylase begins starch to maltose in seconds, while lingual lipase starts fat breakdown into diglycerides. Step 2. Pepsin and gastric lipase. Pepsin, activated from pepsinogen by pH less than 3, cleaves proteins into peptides. It's one of the few proteases that works in acid. Gastric lipase splits triglycerides at the SEN3 position, contributing 10-30% of fat digestion before chyme leaves the stomach. Step 3. Pancreatic enzymes. Pancreatic A amylase continues starch to maltose and oligosaccharides. Trypsin, chymotrypsin elastase, carboxypeptidase, convert peptides to amino acids. Pancreatic lipase with colipase removes fatty acids from triglycerides to monoglycerides ready for micelle uptake. Step 4. Brush border enzymes. Maltase, sucrase, lactase, finish carbohydrate digestion to glucose, fructose, galactose. Peptidases cleave remaining peptides to individual amino acids for absorption. Here's the mind-blowing part. Each enzyme has an optimal pH and cofactor requirement. Amylase works at pH 6.77.0, pepsin at pH 1.52.5, pancreatic enzymes at pH 7.58.5, and you maintain multiple distinct pH zones along your GI tract to maximize enzyme efficiency. Think about this incredible process. Enzyme secretion is regulated by hormones and nerves. Secretin stimulates bicarbonate and pepsinogen. CCK triggers pancreatic enzymes and bile. And vagal signals prime the entire system before food even arrives. But here's where it gets absolutely insane. Enzyme deficiencies cause dramatic malabsorption. Lactase deficiency leads to lactose intolerance. Pancreatic insufficiency causes steatorrhea and brush border defects cause congenital sucrose, isomaltase deficiency. The most incredible part? Enzymes recycle themselves. Digestive enzymes aren't lost in feces. They're rapidly degraded and amino acids recycled. Your body makes 22-25 grams of digestive enzymes daily without depleting your protein stores. Mind blown? Drop a emoji if you never realized that digestion is a precision biochemistry orchestra of over a dozen enzymes each performing its own melody in different pH concert halls from mouth to colon. What other simple body function should I decode next?